Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Millionaire by 25. How are you guys doing today? Well, today I will be showing you something that you might think you already know, but there's more to it and uh, that's uploading videos, uploading and scheduling videos on your YouTube channel. Now, a lot of you might be saying uh, uploading videos, oh, that's something I already know, but one thing you really need to understand is there are advanced way, there, there are specific ways of uploading uh, your videos on YouTube and scheduling it that it becomes productive for you. So I'm going to be showing you how to upload videos and some of our best practices for doing so. So what are we going to be covering on this video course? One is uh, how to upload videos and then we show you how to schedule videos, which is uh, incredibly very useful, a very useful tool. And um, we're also going to be showing you or suggesting the best time to upload videos. Okay. So a lot of people might have their own uh, ideology on uh, when to upload videos, but this can differ. Okay. Some persons might tell you it's 12 o'clock and you might have read online one would say five o'clock. You know, just confusing the hell out of you. But uh, we are going to be looking at that on this video. So don't forget to like, subscribe, click on the notification bell icon to get notified when we drop a video. The video course will start right after the intro. Welcome back. So. First of all, before we start on this video course, I'd like to tell you that if you are looking for that detailed, I mean very highly productive course on YouTube that helps you from beginning to finish, from start to finish, how to create your YouTube channel up till monetization and make tons of money for yourself, all you need to do is go down to the description below and uh, click on the link and purchase the video course. Trust me, if you get that course, you would never regret it. You would make tons of money for yourself highly productive i'm giving you my words okay so back to what we have here okay so like i said in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how to upload and schedule your youtube videos so um if you look at this channel you'll see that there are a lot of videos that are already scheduled uh so when you log into your youtube studio uh this is the first dashboard that you see and then you click create so you can do a bunch of things here now you can upload videos you can go live you can create a post if you can create a, and you can also create a new playlist or you can create a new podcast so let's go to upload videos now this upload videos features is very nice because it can upload multiple videos at once so for the sake of this tutorial i'm just going to upload one video so all you do is just select multiple videos you hold control on your keyboard and then you can select more than one videos so you can see two of them are selected if there's a third one i would definitely select as well and i'll just click open and it uploads but for this video we'll just use one video so let's say we wanted to upload just this one and we'll click open then it gets uploaded on youtube so you can see here, you put in your title and your description and your thumbnail. Now you select the playlist you, you want it to belong to. And then on there, you have your tags and whatnot. And then you can add the recording date and whatever other information that you need to add. Now, the good thing with using the vidiq to upload your videos is that if you look here you see a key uh, keyword inspector so you can inspect whatever keyword you have you can boost the video so if you click boost it shows you like keywords that have good search and good conditions for your particular channel so the higher the score the better the keyword so so you see youtube automation tutorial this is free okay automation tutorial we can add this youtube automation for beginners you can add this you can take all the ones above 70 percent uh so youtube automation step by step is above 70 you can add this one so this is just generally how you go through it now there's no one at uh, 70 so that is how you add tags to your videos if you're wondering how many tags you should add you can just uh like max of what you have here you, you have over 500 characters if you're wondering uh the maximum uh tags to use so you could yeah, come up with something close to 500 as possible you can see you can add a couple more 
So you can see we are, we are pretty close. Now, YouTube automation tutorial for beginners, you can add that. Uh, we're pretty close, 487, and uh, other ones you add is going to go over. So, we have 487, pretty close to 500, as much as we can do. Uh, in one of our previous videos, I discussed some, some base keywords, like uh, keywords that are your, channel, your channel's keyword. Um, tags that you never change. Now, those keywords are going to be in every video. Now, if you have, if you haven't checked out that video, well, it's going to be on the YouTube playlist, so you can go check it out. But for this particular channel, there were some tags which we had already uh, imputed. Something that you would want to do is that these new tags, which VidIQ suggested for you, you want to see how you can add them to your description as much as possible. So if you're going into your description and uh, we already have like a default description, you can add this to your channel settings, which have also been explained in the previous video. So you can come into the description, you can enter and it, it gives you some space. So you can say 15 effective ways to achieve YouTube success. So say this is the title of your video, then you go ahead and add a paragraph here. Say in this video, you teach, we teach you how to do X, Y, Z. So one of the tags that you added was this YouTube automation tutorial for beginners. So you can say in this video, you'll find out in the video, or you'll find out a YouTube automation tutorial for beginners 2023 and then you try as much as you can to add all these tags naturally into your description session uh, section that's really important and once you have done all that then you can click next now something else that uh, the vidiq allows you to do is it allows you to preview this video which are uploading in the search results so if you click preview and the search result you can enter the search time the search time you want to run for the youtube automation tutorial for example 10 hours uh, is five days 15 successful ways to achieve so this is how the video will appear uh, there's no thumbnail because uh, i have not uploaded the thumbnail but once i upload the thumbnail you would see the video so again you see this video Everything is like uh, capital letters. Please don't do this. Only use capital letters to, uh, for emphasis words. So like, see this guy, he said best. Best is in capital. Everything is like, it's just normal. This one completes. So use it for emphasis, okay? So for this one, you can say 15. So you can leave effective in capital and you can just see ways to achieve YouTube success. But anyways, this is just to show you how your video is going to appear in search. So I'm just going to dive right into the scheduling part of the video. So when you get to this point where you get to the schedule your video, now you can decide to upload or publish video at once and that you can make public or like publish once I published this, the video goes live. Now, I don't want to do that. So what you can do inside is to click schedule. And when you click schedule, YouTube is going to give you the opportunity to decide what time you want to uh, sh uh, upload the video. So it to tell you what day you want the video to go live as well and what time you want it to go live. So let's say uh, you work uh, a regular nine to five. You are extremely busy in that case and uh, once you want to create a video once you create all your videos you can do a friday night uh create you can do a friday night create all your videos take out saturday and upload every single video so you can upload everything to go one video per day so one goes live on monday one goes live on tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday just as as and so on and so forth so your audience would see your video go live every day and for those who don't know they would think that you are actually live on the channel you're active on the channel but you can actually be working on youtube only on weekends you get that 
But if the YouTube channel is going to produce content that goes live every single day, that's something really good with scheduling videos. So you can bulk edit, you can bulk upload videos and set your channel up and be free for the rest of the week. So this is something that you want to do, deciding the time when you want to upload the video depending on your audience. So let's say you have uh, an audience from the US or from Canada or from Nigeria, just whichever one. That will determine the time you should upload your video. Now let us look at how to know the right time to upload your video. Now you check online, you see a lot of people would, would tell you 5 a.m., 7 a.m. or 5 p.m., 7 p.m. and as the case may be. But I think it differs with your own analytics. You have to study your analytics to know when people actually view your uh, channel more. Me, uh, another technique I use is um, this. Now, let, let me share this with you. So if you go into your analytics and uh, you go to your audience, you can see the countries your audience are from. So in Nigeria, we have 4.3% of the audience. Canada, United States, Australia, United Kingdom. So deciding a time to upload videos can be very tricky because uh, Nigeria and UK have similar time zone. So you can capture these two audience at the same time. But Canada and United States are like eight hours behind. So uh, this is where YouTube tool is also very helpful. So it can tell you the best time to upload videos based on your audience. But that is beyond the scope of this video. Um, which we'll be covering on another video. So I hope this video gives you guys some insights and uh, I hope it was helpful. Now, if you have not subscribed, don't forget, subscribe to our channel and uh, click on the notification bell icon to get notified when we drop a new video. Uh, because I don't know what you guys are doing. More than 84% of you guys who watch these videos and you don't subscribe. I don't know what you're waiting for. So hit on the subscribe button and see you guys in the next video course.